Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie, and today I'm here with a sneak peek unboxing of one of Diamond Art Club's new releases this week. The thing I have to share with you all is called Sugar High by Lizzie Falcon, and my goodness has this artist been so very highly anticipated at Diamond Art Club. Uh, this kit is going to be pretty big, 50.8 by 103.8 centimeters, we're going to get all that fantastic detail in her tattoos. Um, it's gonna have square shaped diamonds that'll help us get that detail as well. And this kit along with the other new releases are gonna be coming out tomorrow, which is Saturday, March 9th at 9.30 a.m. Pacific, 12.30 p.m. Eastern. If you're in the Diamond or Ruby tier, the rewards program, you do get a half an hour early access window. You'll, you can either watch for an email or text. Um, with that access link or if you're logged into your account and you go to the new arrivals section You'll be able to see the new releases beginning at that early release time So anyway, you guys let me just give you a quick snapshot of the features of the box and everything So they do use blue branding with their square drill kits here and then on the back There's some information about how to diamond paint and then we have your kit contents written out for you here And then there is a QR code here that you can scan for 10% off your purchase if you are brand new to diamond art club I'm thinking of making your very first purchase. I also have a 20% off affiliate discount code you're welcome to use. It's just my name, Katie, K-A-T-I-E, and the number 20. And like I said, that's just for your first purchase. And there's no obligation whatsoever to use it because I may make a small commission and want to make sure you know that. All I'll say is that just use some kind of discount code on your purchase. At this point, Diamond Art Club just, they don't want us to be paying full price for, for our kits. So um, you'll see some of their discount codes actually just in this video as well. So we do have a toolkit here that's going to have uh, everything we need to do, our diamond painting. Here's what your contents will be. And let's see here. Okay, so you are going to get a pen and a little comfort squishy there. The color on these is going to vary. You're also going to get some thin plastic multi-placers in case you want to try your hand at placing more than one diamond at a time. You can just pop those into the end of your pen. You get a four placer and a seven placer. We've also got a pair of tweezers. They are quite sharp, so you wanna make sure you keep that cover on when you're not using those. We've got a bag of plastic baggies. You can store your leftover diamonds in if you like. We have some pink wax in this caddy here. Two little hearts of it, and you just wanna make sure you peel back that thin plastic film that's on either side, um, on one side at least, before you try to load up your pen. We also have a tray, and there's also a tray stopper. You can pop that in the end, that'll help stop the diamonds from sliding out of your tray. And then we've got a roll of washi tape, which the print on this will vary, and I do have a video dedicated to how, where, when, why, the ways that I use washi tape when it comes to my diamond paintings. So you'll find that linked below if you're curious. And then this is a cover minder. The style on this will vary. This is super, super cute. Uh, there are magnets on the back. You can use it to hold back the plastic cover while you're working in it also is just really cute. So <laughs> that is your toolkit. Like I said, really it feels like everything you need to do your diamond painting. And then Diamond Art Club does also include this smaller logbook sticker. Uh, I like to use this in my paper logbook once I start working on a kit. I like that it has the title and the artwork and some of the stats. Some people use this to help organize their stash by putting it on the side of their box or you can find something else crafty to do with it. Everything else is gonna be included in this plastic bag or branded dust cover. And like I said, this is a bigger canvas. We're gonna get all the details. It looks like this is the bottom. Oh my gosh, look at the detail on those tattoos. That already is so clear, just from the printing on the canvas, dang. Wow, 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 okay. And this really, really gorgeously characteristic style that Lizzie Falcon has with her characters and her hair, oh my gosh. Look at all the individual highlighted strands you can see. That is quite the showstopper. Wow, okay, I'm gonna, since we aren't looking at this whole thing in frame very easily right here, if you take a look at the screen, I will pop up a picture for you of the whole canvas in frame. And then also included with your kit here, we've got a pamphlet. There's some helpful info in here, including 
what's included in your kit, a beginner video, which I'll have one linked below that I've done as well. Here's a link to the VIP Facebook group, which you can join once you've made your, you've made your very first purchase. It's a handy resource. Uh, here's some step-by-step -step instructions written out for you, as well as some tips and tricks. And there's another discount code. Uh, these QR codes will take you to the mobile app. You get 20% off your first purchase through the app as well. And it's, you know, you can sign up for push notifications and stuff if you like. Then you're also going to get this larger sticker sheet. There is the title here, Sugar High by Lizzie Falcon. A spot to write your start and end date. And here you can have a, a little bit better look at the original artwork. Even just, oh, can you kind of, you can see how they've kind of tried to write out the word in her tattoo here. And... Yeah, well, there's a lot of details going on there. Uh, so here are the stats at the bottom as well. And then over here, you guys, we have a set of pre-cut sticker labels. Looks like there's gonna be a total of 61 colors in this kit. And these are pre-cut for you. So if you were to go ahead and put the diamonds into storage containers or baggies, you can put these stickers on there and the labels just, the whole process goes really quickly since these are pre-cut and ready to go. The color code system you see in the right hand column is the DMC color code system. It comes from the DMC brand of floss. Most diamond painting companies use this color code system. There are a couple of things that are unique to Diamond Art Club that I want to point out though. Anything under the number 150 is gonna be a special kind of drill type called an AB. So we're gonna have four AB colors in this particular kit. If you look at the end of your color list as well, you may sometimes see some codes that have a letter at the beginning. In this case, we have two that have the letter Z and that um, indicates a fairy dust color. So we're gonna have two of those. I am gonna be sure to show those to you when we're looking at the diamonds and I'll explain a little bit more um, about what those different special drill types are, which there's a little sneak peek at our diamonds and our color spread there. Let me take you on a little tour of the canvas though. So up here at the top, we have their branding, Do It Makes You Sparkle, Diamond Art Club. The edges of the canvas are scalloped and have these pokes here, so you shouldn't have to worry about any fraying. The backing is really soft and plush, and the material of the canvas itself is, I mean, it's it's sturdy and malleable. I find it's just a nice, almost like luxurious kind of material, and it holds the diamonds really well. There's this thin plastic, or there's this plastic cover, and there's poured glue on the canvas itself. And the plastic cover features one of these la um, latest upgrades from Diamond Art Club, which is a perforated, cover sheet, plastic cover sheet. So if you can see kind of the dotted lines on there, the full sizes of the sections are about four by four inches, 10 by 10 centimeters, I believe, ish. And you can ignore them if you so choose. You don't have to use those. You can use plastic, the plastic cover how you were using it before. But if you do want to make use of them, all you have to do if you wanna go ahead and separate a section and peel it off or pull it back is just tug where the perforation meets there and it should split pretty easily for you there. And then you're gonna find a legend or a, you know key code, a color list up here at the top left, as well as down here at the bottom right on a canvas. The size I'm gonna recommend that maybe you don't rely too much on the legends on the canvas because you might have to go kind of far to look at them. I would recommend referring to the stickers that you put on however you're storing your diamonds and just look at those instead. Uh, down here at the bottom left, you'll find a thumbnail of the original artwork, the title, the size, and then of course, copyright Lizzie Falcon Art and Diamond Art Club. What this means is that this piece has been legally licensed. The artist is both given permission for the use of her artwork and is being fairly compensated for it as well. This is the case with all of Diamond Art Club's kits. They are all above board and licensed from the artist. So like I said, this is the debut piece from Lizzie Falcon at Diamond Art Club. Over here, we have their socials and yet another discount code. And then here is a little bit info about their lifetime warranty. This includes if you run out of any diamonds, um, if you're as long as you're the original owner and purchaser of your kit, you're covered under that warranty. It includes if you run out of any diamonds or have any trouble with the canvas or glue, uh, you can contact their customer support and they can take it from there. Looking at the canvas itself here up close, we have kind of some polar opposites going on here, you guys. So there are some areas like a lot of in her skin and in the background that have what we would call color blocking. There's large blocks of color here all in a small area. You'll be able to use a multi-placer and have that color in your tray for a bit longer. And so that tends to go a little bit more quickly. Then especially as we get into some of the, like the tattoos and the bits of detail, 
we're looking at maybe a little bit more of what we call confetti. Confetti is when you have more color changes in a small area. You might be doing more single placing or just placing a couple of drills here and there of a color. You'll be changing out the color in your tray a little bit more often and um, that tends to go a little bit slower but you do tend to get more detail and sometimes some nice kind of color shifts as well. I love the bright colors in her hair. There's some color blocking in the background too. And definitely in her in her skin. It's very highly stylized artwork. It looks like from Lizzie Falcon's original artwork to this, I am really impressed with how it looks like it's translating. Diamond Art Club's hand charting, I feel like is, you can really, really see it paying off when it comes to this kit. So let me grab my measuring tape. We will we'll attempt. We will attempt to measure this long canvas and just see if we're true to size. Diamond Art Club kits usually do run true to size, but I do like to double check just to see. Oh, I moved that. Hold on a second. All right, so we are at 103-ish centimeters. We're listed as 103.8, probably a little bit off just because where my hand shifted there. I'm still gonna call it close enough, you guys. <laughs> and then this way, we're at about 51 centimeters and we're listed as 50.8. So I'm gonna call that true to size. Okay, let's take a look at the diamonds. Let me just set this so you can see her in the background. Um, there's a sticker on the diamonds that tells you what kit these go with in case you store them separate from the canvas. Okay, there are those colors again. Look at that sparkle, my goodness. Uh, so it looks like right here, we just have this one little straggler strand, some pinks and purples. And then um, we do have the DMC code printed right on these heat sealed bags. Four bags that white color. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bags of 310, you guys. 310 is black, that'll be in the background. Uh, Diamond Art Club does make all of their diamonds in-house, both their squares and their rounds. Some bright reds there. And I find that their squares are really gorgeously faceted and uh, tend to be pretty darn consistent in quality, which means uh, there's, I find that there's generally pretty minimal trash as in unusable diamonds. Um, they're pretty consistent in size and shape and they do give extra. If you happen to run out though, you can contact customer support and they can get you taken care of there. No special drills yet, <laughs> we'll get there. Uh, Diamond Arco does put their diamonds here in these strands roughly in order of weight. Um, and here is, oh, here's our first special diamond. 131, this is an AB diamond, and AB stands for Aurora Borealis. These actually get their name from the Northern Lights, and they have this really gorgeously bold iridescent coating that's on the tops of these diamonds. Um, it's really eye-catching, and it's gonna draw your eye to the areas that has been charted. So this is our first of four AB colors. Right next to it is our first fairy dust color. These I'd like to zoom in on in particular. Uh, fairy dust colors have literally like a glitter dust that looks like it's been brushed on the top of them. And these have a more shimmery effect, kind of a subtle effect. So you've got ABs, nice bold coating, and then our fairy dust, they're right next to each other. <laughs> so that really pretty purple color. Here's our second AB, 128. It is a pale pink AB. And our next, our second of two fairy dust colors, Z3607. It's just a really pretty pink. It's a very bold pink color. Glitter on there. I will say that, frankly, fairy dust, that's my favorite special drill type the Diamond Art Club has, personally. 141, that's our third AB. It's a white AB. You'll see this one in a lot of Diamond Art Club kits. It's a good one. And so many colors. It's very very rainbowy it feels like in terms of just the sheer variety of colors that are in this kit my goodness and here we've got our final our fourth and final ab color 100 it's kind of a pale green color just a small amount of those 
And yeah, like I started to say earlier, these are in order of weight in these strands. It's not in order of DMC code, just in case you were curious. <laughs> There's the end. So let's take a look from the bottom to the top of the canvas and we will find where we're gonna find these AB colors. So let me just quick give myself a quick refresher. So the, um, the ABs and the fairy dust, both special drill types. Sorry, I think I just said ABs. So we've got one, two, three, and four are our AB colors. Then we kind of have these swiggly lines and the hourglass for the fairy dust. Cement that in my brain as we go. Okay, so right off the bat, I see some of the um, pale orange AB in the center of this flower. And then the pale pink AB here in the middle of this ice cream cone. That's more the pale, the light orange AB in here. And then the purple fairy dust. It's one of the medium purple colors in these flowers. Not the darkest, not the lightest. That's gonna give some shimmer to these, these gorgeous flowers in her tattoo. It's in here as well. Then we have some of the white AB. Is all the white that's in here. I think that that's, that might be a word in the original artwork, um, kind of like scripted. And then there's some orange ABs in here. And then, let me see. Over here, there's some of the pale pink ABs. Not part of the tattoo. And make sure I don't miss anything. Yeah, there, I was wondering, I was like, where's that green? I'm seeing some green, is there the green AB? Yes, there's a little bit of the light green AB right in here. I haven't seen any of the pink fairy dust yet. I'm keeping an eye out for it though. Um, some of the light orange AB is in her hair over here and uh, the light green AB is in her hair right here and the light pink AB is right here. Then if we hop back over here, there's white ABs right here. It's kind of like a straw and a, some kind of treat here. <laughs> I think it's a milkshake. There's some pink ABs as well. And then no pink fairy dust yet. I'm watching you. Oh, here it is in this heart. Ooh, glare. Sorry. Hold on. Flip this open anyway. Um, in the center of this heart, you guys, that is all pink fairy dust. <laughs> Gonna give that heart quite a shimmery effect. And then the heart next to it has a bunch of the light orange AB in it. This heart, uh, the white you see is white AB. And there's a little bit of pink fairy dust in the ribbon too. And then there's white ABs up in this donut, as well as some pink ABs in the middle. And then there's two orange ABs right here. <laughs> and then let's see, we've got some pink ABs in her hair here, some orange ABs in her hair here, and more pink ABs right here. Here's some more pink fairy dust is in this part of her hair. <clears throat> Make sure I'm still in frame, yep. And then there's some pink ABs here in the top of this. It's like a Sunday. And let me hop over to this part of her hair and let's see, we do have some uh, pink ABs, orange ABs, and any fairy dust? I don't think so. Okay. Let's keep going. Uh, some of the light green AB, there's a little bit of it right here. She's got a lot of amazing colors in her hair. Uh, orange AB here. And let me see, there's, I just, I, you know, I don't want to miss it if I can help it. Pink fairy dust right here and right here. And then if we hop over here, her earring has a bunch of that light green AB in it. And there's some pink AB right here and here. There's some pink fairy dust in here as well as right here. Some more pink AB right there. Let's see. Yes, so in her eyes, we have some of the white AB is the whites in her eyes. And then there's a little bit of pink fairy dust right here. Hopping up here, there's some orange AB and some more orange AB up here and going around up here. And then there's orange AB right here. And I think, I think that'll do it. I think that'll do it. So I love all the special drills in her hair. I think that that's an amazing touch. And the special drills that are just kind of, I feel like nicely and strategically placed throughout her tattoos to really, I think, just bring those to life even more. This looks really, really, really good. And there have been a couple of different companies um, that have licensed this artist in the past. And just at first glance, the rendering on this one looks like it is just 
fantastic. Like it's the best that I feel like I've seen so far and I'm excited and hopeful to see what else we might see from this artist at Diamond Art Club because I, I'm impressed you guys, but I would really, really love to hear from you as far as what your first impressions are. Like I said, I know this artist has been very, very highly anticipated. A lot of people were really excited to see um, this, this preview. By the way, if you are in the VIP Facebook group, they actually, Diamond Art Club, has this kit completed as the cover photo for that group. So if you want to take a look and see how it looks completed, go and go and uh, take a look in that group if you're in it. So <laughs> I can't share it here because it's, you know, part of that group. But um, if you want a little sneak peek there, definitely, definitely go and take a look. I, it's honestly, though, let's let's be clear. That's it's just going to enable you and make you want it more. It looks amazing. So let me give you a super quick recap on this kit and the release uh, time and everything. So the title on this one is Sugar High. It's by Lizzie Falcon, the very first kit that's releasing from this artist at Diamond Art Club. It is on the bigger side, 50.8 by 103.8 centimeters, but lots of color blocking and a lot of parts. So I think it'll move along uh, pretty well. <clears throat> and feel pretty manageable. It's got 61 colors with square diamonds. It's got four ABs and two fairy dust colors. And this one along with the other new releases is coming out tomorrow, which is Saturday, March 9th at 9.30 a.m. Pacific, 12.30 p.m. Eastern. Don't forget the Ruby and Diamond tier members <clears throat> to uh, check your email or log in for that early access window. Sorry, you guys, I'm losing my voice. That's going. Um, I'm gonna let you go. Feel free to subscribe, please. If you want to see more diamond painting content, I do lots of unboxings, reviews, tutorials, um, weekly whip and chats, and I would absolutely love to have you here. Thank you so much for watching. I look forward to reading your thoughts below in the comment section, and <clears throat> I hope you have a day and a week that's as amazing as you are. I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.